with retail thefts on the rise, Walmart CEO says they'll have to start raising prices or even close some stores. Eyewitness News reporter Mark Robles live in Porter Ranch with the details on that. Mark. Yeah, John, good morning. Theft, of course, is nothing new, but the real issue here, the increase is in organized retail theft when a large group goes into a store to take a lot of merchandise all at once and leave in a hurry, and that's happening at stores like Walmart. The CEO speaking out yesterday on this issue in an interview saying that these thefts could lead to prices going up, as you mentioned, even store closures. He indicated that that could be the case if prosecutors continue to have a lax approach to these shoplifting crimes. The CEO saying each store location has security measures in place. The other part of the equation is partnering with local law enforcement to hopefully correct this over time. This news from Walmart follows statewide efforts to tackle the issue. A retail crime task force with the California Highway Patrol has increased their presence at shopping centers this holiday shopping season to heighten visibility and make arrests. And that task force has had success since its inception. The task force has recovered merchandise valued at nearly $26 million. This video released yesterday by the LAPD shows that this isn't a Walmart issue. Back out live, rival stores like Target also seeing a major increase in retail theft this year, recently reporting $400 million more in losses this year compared to last year. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.